we can finally say it. The NBA regular season is about to get underway. And here at 2K Sports, we couldn't be happier. And tonight, we'll see the Houston Rockets as they go up against the Los Angeles Lakers. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. exciting days of the year. Yeah, everybody's starting from the same place. It's a bit of a reset for everybody. Any team has the opportunity to make their mark on this season. Last season, that's behind everybody. It's an exciting time looking forward. Now here's Bryant, and stolen by Yao. Martin inside, defended by Bryant. Martin dishes to Scola. Lowry passes to Martin. Back to Lowry. Here's the teardrop. And he sinks the layup. Lowry's got the scoreboard going with his first points of the night for the Rockets. Scola against Odom. This all setting the pick for Odom. To the middle and stolen by Yao. Lowry against Fisher. First quarter of play, one minute play, and it's Ron Artest with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. Yeah, quick foul to pick up right away here in the first quarter. Lakers on D. Houston moving it around. Martin against Bryant. Six to shoot. The tray. Well, I tell you what, Kobe gets after it defensively now. Desire and determination on full display. He wants to shut folks down. About a minute and a half through the first quarter. Rockets with the rebound. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And, guys, that's exactly the kind of high-impact defense they want to see out of him. Outside, Mark. That ball's nice feed that time from Kyle Lowry. You can't leave Martin open from deep like that, though I'm not sure that D was expecting him to shoot it from out there. Here's Fisher, pass to Gasol. Second chance effort, and he lays it up and in. Great anticipation by Gasol, converts off the miss. The Rockets have gone two or three here to start out the game. Lowry against Fisher. Lowry feeling it out a bit. Doesn't go for him. Lakers have gone one of three from the field to start this one so far. Here's Odom. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. Getting aggressive with the jump shot. Lamar Odom refusing to back down. Lowry against Fisher. Now, here's Lowry. He's covered closely. Plays it up and banks it in. Lowry's got his second basket of the game. Yeah, well done to finish that one off. Pass to Bryant. And the dunk by Kobe. Well, I don't know what the adjective should be. Incredible, amazing, fantastic. I mean, we watch Kobe night in and night out make plays like that, and the spectacular for him is routine. Now here is Lowry. No one covers. How Lowry with a beautiful setup. And so Fisher will bring it up for Los Angeles. Four-point game. This, is, of course, their first opportunity to play Houston. And while well, they swept the season series against them last year, making it pretty clear how much separation exists between the two teams. I mean, one is a playoff team. The other, question mark, dot, 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 not so much. But things change, and you're only as good as your last win. So we'll see how they handle things tonight. And here's Martin after Ron Artest hitting the three. 
It's good. Martin's got five points so far. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Now here's Kobe. Rebound by Yao. Now you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. Well, you know, I hear you. That's a good look. But when you're that wide open, I think you got to knock it down. Lowry against our test. Lowry passes to Scola. Nice D from Odom. You know, I think the effort on defense there has everything to do with why he missed that shot. Well done. That one goes in. Ron Artest, a willing passer, does a good job that time of surveying the floor and making the right play. Here's Lowry. Lamar Odom picking up that last basket. Castillo, Kobe with the steal. Odom inside, now recovering, and there's Lamar Odom on the assist by Bryant. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets have been exactly of that variety. And for a power forward, he can sure get up. I mean, because of that leaping ability, it kind of offsets his height disadvantage. Now, here is our test. Here's Gasol. Count it. Those defenders just look a little bit gassed. I mean, they're getting pushed around on that low block. Here's Lowry. Outside, Scola. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. To the paint. Here's Odom. Good work defensively by Yao. The Rockets trail. Now Lowry. Outside, Martin. Fires the three. The shot's good on the assist by Lowry. Martin's got eight. A certified sniper. Martin can be so consistent from range. And out of bounds as the Rockets gain possession. Eight in scoring. And they were in the top ten in terms of free throw percentage. Very consistent from the strike, an asset. And as for the offensive rebounding, we're just talking about GA. They, they committed a lot of bodies to the paint, and it was a strategy that worked out great for them. Houston's gone three or four on three pointers in the first quarter, doing well from long range. Fisher against Lowry. Outside, Mark. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Lakers have gone 7 of 11 from the field to begin the game. And the basket by Kobe. Kobe's got it all tied up now for the Lakers. Attacking in transition, the most consistent way to generate easy looks. Yep, exactly. And if there's any opportunity for early offense, you've got to push it and push it every time. Yeah, and that was lining up to be a huge alley-oop, but they just couldn't quite connect. And you know, guys, always a tough catch on the lob. Placement and timing have to be close to perfect. Lowry against Fisher. Outside Lowry. Offensive With the break in the action, we've got a chance now to look at last year's top rebounders. Fourth, Pau Gasol. What a season he had in the paint. I mean, his rebounding numbers, really mind-boggling. Who wouldn't love to have a guy like that? Houston making a switch. Brooks checked in. Sasha Vujicic has checked in for the Lakers. Odom with a screen on Yacht. Feeds it to Gasol. Over Yao. A nice shot by Gasol. Six points for Paul Gasol. Moving it around, eight of their last ten coming off assists. You know, nothing makes a coach happier than selflessness on the basketball court. Now, here's Lowry. Yao in the post, working on Gasol. The jump hook, no good from Yao. Lakers leading by four. How about this run, Craig? They're on right now. Wow. I mean, they're just getting to their spots and executing. Really keeping things simple. Going upstairs, Mr. Artest. Yes, sir. And now the first time out called here for the Rockets.
Jeffries, who's checked in for the Rockets. Taylor comes in for Kyle Lowry. And then for Los Angeles, Walton's checked in for Odom. Barnes comes in for Ron Artest. And Steve Blake is subbed in for Fisher. Brooks guarded by Blake will it go here's Jeffries good on the three-point shot and he's not gonna miss that sort of an opportunity from deep and here's Blake he'll bring it up for Los Angeles three-point lead the pass to Gasol now Walt Lakers need to get a shot off here. Shot clock at two. Hands it from downtown. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Yeah, they're lasered in. I mean, really making the most of their possessions. Now here's Brooks. He has yet to score. Has to out. The rebound by Blake. Los Angeles leading by six. Vujicic the pass to Walt. Excellent D there for Scola. For Houston, they've gone 50% from the field in the first quarter, 8 of 16. Jeffries can't get it to go. LA's gone 2 of 2 from three-point range here in the first quarter. Blake dishes to Walton. He feeds it to Gasol. That one, no good. Good work defensively by Young. Houston's gone four and six from long range here early on. Yao with a screen on Barnes. Barnes against Taylor. He kicks to Jeffries. And some nice passing there by Houston. Here's Brooks. Goes to the reverse layup and pops it in. And their post play has been really solid right off the bat. The Lakers in the lead. Blake passes to Barnes. Walton with the ball. Passes it to Blake from past the arc. It's rebounded by Houston. Gow's got four rebounds now tonight. Here is Jeffries. To the inside. And stolen by Gasol. Now the Lakers on the break. Here's Vujicic. Basket is good. The assist from Barnes. And the Lakers lead by seven. Terrific focus from Vujicic. He was totally locked in and prepared to take his shot. Timeout called. The Rockets. Miller's checked in for Yao. Hayes comes in for Luis Stola. And it's Martin in for Taylor. Ratliff's checked in for Los Angeles. Kobe comes in for Walton. Here's Brooks. Outside, Martin. Over to the left wing. Here's Miller. And that one drops. Punch, counter punch. Impressive offensive production early on. Hey, guys, this is going to be fun now. I mean, we've got ourselves a shootout on tap here. Here's Vujicic. Pass to Kobe. Shoots the three. And it's Hayes with the rebound. Just doing the job on the back door. They sure are. I mean, they've done a terrific job carving out space under the basket and then pursuing the ball. You know, it's one thing to box out, but you've got to pursue the ball if you're going to get rebounds. And um, they look strong here in the early going. Here's Bryant following the score by Houston. There's the pick. Fires the three. The Rockets pull it in. 
You know, guys, you can tell he wants to contribute more, but his teammates have picked up the slack for him. That's what being on the team is all about. And as it goes out of bounds, Houston able to keep the ball. Now into the lineup for the Lakers, number 82, Darren Hughes. Inside, just three on the clock, and scoring with the play inside is Brooks. Now just a one-point Laker lead, a good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. Lakers ahead, up one. It's the NBA on 2K Sports from Toyota Center. This has been a fairly close game through the first quarter, and we'll see what happens here in the second. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Los Angeles. They've really been pushing that thing in the open floor, and so far, the opposition's not been able to slow them down at all. And another thing, guys, that they've been very active tonight, frequently creating scoring opportunities off turnovers. Now here's Higgins. Hasn't made one yet. Just two to shoot, and that gives them the lead. And the Rockets lead by one. And Martin's almost automatic from mid-range. He's skilled at getting that little bit of wiggle room he needs to release it. Here's Barnes. Now the dish to Harper. And there's the pass to Blake. Here's Bryant. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. And with the moment, let's check out some stats for Bryant. Coming off a terrific season. Last season, 27 points per, five assists, and five rebounds. And he was their top scorer throughout last season. Well, his teammates knew whenever they really needed a basket, just look his way. Ratliff's checked in for Harper. Outside, Martin. Brooks setting the pick for Martin. Here's the three. It's hauled in by Theo Ratliff. Well, it looks like he's cooled down a bit after hitting those two in the first quarter. Blake kicks to Kobe. Blake passes to Kobe. They set the pick. And Kevin Martin pulls it down. Houston's gotten a success rate of just over 50% from three-point tonight. Four of seven shooting. And they repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for Houston. Uh, they've looked to fire as much as possible from outside the arc, and so far they are hitting at a high clip. One other thing they've done really well, moving the ball around. They've done a nice job not settling for that initial option and making that extra pass. That one misses for Brooks. So here we are, Clark, looking at the 2010 rookie class. Maybe a slight drop-off when you look at the overall talent level from 2009. But any sleepers you've got your eye on here? Yeah, I always have my eye on a few under-the-radar guys. A couple of them are at picks 9 and 10. Gordon Hayward and Paul George. Very athletic wings, both long and rangy. Those guys always valuable because of their two-way potential. I'm a little surprised both of them fell to the back part of the lottery. And it's off from three-point range. Lakers trail by three. Now the feed to Blake. On the wing right, covered by Mark. Blake passes to Ratliff. Over Miller. No good from Ratliff. Rockets leading by three. And a little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the second quarter. Here is Jeffries. 
five points in the game. Miller sets a screen for Brooks. Ratliff sends it back. And they also showed up defensively. <laughs> Top five in terms of opponent field goal percentage. They really won a lot of games on that side of the floor. And, and you just mentioned it. What a year it was for them on the glass. The sheer effort and energy they put into their rebounding was tremendous. So for the Rockets, Mattier comes in for Jared Jeffries. And it's Lowry in for Aaron Brooks. And the Lakers also making a change. Hughes is checked in for it. Here's Vujicic. Pass to Kobe. They could use a bucket. There's the three ball by Bryant. You know, you've got to guard Kobe the moment he crosses half court. He's got that kind of range, and he doesn't have any reservations about letting it fly. Outside Lowry. Over Blake. The Rockets again can't hit. And so Blake will bring it up for the Lakers. Defense has only allowed four points in the quarter. Those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. Making a statement for sure. I mean, we'll see if they can maintain that aggressive approach, guys. Martin with the bucket. And that gets him going here in the second after hitting two from long range in that first. Blake passes to Kobe. They set the pick. A floater. A strong finish inside by Kobe Bryant. Such great touch there from Bryant on the runner. Nice. For Houston, they've gone three of seven shooting the ball here in the second quarter. Passes it to Hayes. Dishes to Battier. Miller with a screen on Bryant. Pass to Martin. Pulls up. That ball is good for another field goal. His sixth. He is six for nine on the stat sheet. He has created some terrific opportunities for himself and really made the most of it. So timeout called here. The first for Los Angeles. also making some changes. Odom, he's jacked in for Barnes. And Fisher subbed in for Steve Blake. Odom with it. He has six. Down low. Well, let's take a look at last year's top scorers. Kobe Bryant, fourth. And looking back, his points per game really underscored the fact that he never took a game off. I mean, one special performance after another all season long. That one falls for Hughes. Second free throw, no good. Yeah. Look, you'd like to take the lead on that possession, but he, at least he was able to tie the game up. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. And Battier is the full package pro, a knockdown three ball specialist who also gets it done by working hard on the defensive end, too. Rockets have shot just one free throw, missing that one earlier. And their numbers from the line last season, they're good, just not great, about 77% as a team. You know, they would love to post a similar percentage again this season. I mean, I think that's safe to say they'd love to shoot free throws as well as they did a year ago. Free throw drops for Battier.
He hits one, then misses the second attempt from the free throw line. The Lakers trade. And the pass to Vujicic. Lakers working the ball around now. Odom's shot, good. And what energy from Odom, just outworking the defense right there. Now, here's Lowry. Outside, Mark. Six on the shot clock. Over Odom. The Rockets with another miss. Boy, he's got to be disappointed in the result there. I mean, the defender really didn't make any impact at all. And he gets the bucket. Now it's a three-point Laker lead. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. Yeah, and they're really getting pummeled on points in the paint here. Nesty out. Kicks to Battier. Left side, Martin. Over Vujicic. Martin with the bucket. Martin's got nine points in the quarter. And he is really in a zone right now, playing and scoring with confidence. Outside, Bryant. It's Bryant converting down low. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. Rockets trail by three. And here's Lowe. Here's Martin. And the rebound goes to Odom. Odom's got his fourth rebound in this one. Fisher finds Bryant. Over Battier. Good! Kobe with a hand in his face. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Three-pointer, Martin, and another three for Houston. Now he's drained two threes in each quarter so far. And so Bryant will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Passes it to Vujicic. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. That one on Martin. Oldham's length able to be put to good use to draw the foul there. Lakers shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. Two shots. First one falls. You know, the versatility Oldham offers is really hard to match up with. He's a fantastic ball handler and passer, and for a big man, that separates his game. Luis Scola, he's checked in for Houston. Brooks comes in for Kevin Martin. Gasol's checked in for the Lakers. Artest comes in for Bryant. And Odom drops him. Yeah, a nice job of drawing the contact and creating opportunities at the line. My kind of boot. Straight ahead, playing downhill and physical. Now here's Scola. Still yet to score. It's good. That was just a perfect possession. Getting it in tight for the high percentage shot. Now Fisher, Odin with a screen on low. Gasol on the wing. with the block. And you have to appreciate the reach of me. Superb at putting himself in a good position there to block the shot. Now here's Brooks. He has six. Moves back up. And it's Yao getting it to go down. Yao's got his first bucket in this one. Now that's how you pick up second chance points. Stay active and be ready as soon as the shot goes up. Back to Fisher. Offside Odom. Baseline try. And Fisher gets it to go on the assist by Odom. Fisher's got his second bucket tonight. For Houston, they've gone 8 of 15 since we began the second quarter. Excellent shooting. Brooks outside. Here's Scola. A rebound by the Lakers. Gasol's got six rebounds in the game. 
Vujicic kicks it to Odom. And slam dunk by Odom. Right now, Odom all in his back. He's a very effective scorer when he uses his full two kit. Brooks, the pass to Lowry. Back to Brooks. The kick out to Scope. That drops and it comes off an assist from Brooks. Scope has got his second basket. It all started with the pass. That's what coaches love to see. Ball movement. Gasol is screen on Scope. Odom dishes to Gasol. Rebound by Yao Ming. Yao's got his sixth rebound on the night. Mattier, the pass to Lauer. Brooks outside. Here's Yao. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. They get Paul Gasol. Yao is such a big guy, and his physicality that time rewarded. Rockets have shot one of three from the line tonight, two missing shots. two earlier on. One falls for him. And, you know, he's such a huge figure from a cultural standpoint. Yao is also someone teammates love playing with because of that easygoing personality. Kevin Martin is checked in for the Rockets. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Brown's checked in. No good on the second free throw. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. We've seen it time and time again in games. Effort and determination on the glass can make up for a lot of other weaknesses. Now, here is our test. Five points in the game. Here's the drive, and the shot is good. Our test's got seven points in the game. And the grit our test showing here as he finishes through some pretty physical contact. But this guy too strong to let that kind of physical play bother him. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. And not the most common call you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue that pick wasn't illegal. Yeah, you know, the officials aren't nearly as lenient as they used to be on that call. As a matter of fact, I know I got away with a lot of those in my playing days, but that was 40 years ago. Los Angeles leading by three. Brown outside. He kicks it to Odom. Good looking screen by Gasol. Odom the pass to Gasol. Good work defensively by Yao. Houston's gone six of ten from three point range up over 50% for the ball game. Martin against Brown. And Brown over to help. Out to Battier. That misses. Had a chance to tie it there. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. And the dunk by Odom. When they serve it up for Odom like this, you know what's coming. A throwdown with power. Rockets trail by five. Lowry with the ball. Puts up a deep three. Lakers with the rebound. Gasol's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Outside, Fisher. Gasol setting the pit for Odin. The 11-footer, and again, it's the Lakers. And not really a go-to shot for Odin, but he can adjust his power just enough to knock down that mid-range. We've got a nine-second image between the shot clock and the game clock. Lowry passes to Battier. Martin for three. Gasol with the rebound. And, and they continue to control the glass. Guys, I think they've simply been the more physical team, and that's why they're ahead. To the middle. Yao 
Gasol with the block. And he recovers it. And so it's Lamar Odom making highlights. Had to take a lot out of him. He racked up 12 points. We'll get right back to the action when we return. We played through the first half. Plenty of basketball, though, left in this one. Really an incredible game from Kevin Martin. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate within the first few quarters. And you know what? It helped that they had a few guys with very hot hands on the perimeter, too. And we hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. We're halfway through the game. Now here is Lowry, outside Scola. He dishes it to Battier. Back to Scola. Over Odom. Scola, no luck. Well, that's a rare miss for him inside. He may have just rushed it a bit. Maybe lost concentration, too. Back to Odom. Outside for Gasol. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Our test the pass to Bryant. Five on the clock. Shot from the top of the key. And it hung on the rim, but wouldn't fall for him. Pass to Lowry. There's the dish to Scola. Martin wide open. He fires. Knocks down the three ball. Martin's got the first field goal, the second half for the Rockets. Lakers leading by six. Now the pass to our test for three. Kobe. The Rockets pull it in. Yao's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. To the paint. And finished off by Martin. Well, Martin knows this is what the team is counting on for him. Finding good looks. Outside our test. Pass to Gasol. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. And on the flip side, the defenders have to show more fight on the interior. They've got to offer more resistance here. And he's got his first chance at the line here. And taking a look back at his performance at the line a year ago, a rock solid 79%. That free throw good from Gasol. You know, you watch Powell Gasol, and he's got unbelievable length and really outstanding skill and the desire to be great. Now a timeout called by Houston. All right, a moment here to check out stats for Kyle Lowry. How he performed last season. Averaged about nine points per game. Four assists and three rebounds. And every team wants a score to give them a lift off the bench, and, and that's just what he brings. Well, he's instant offense. I mean, the game's momentum can be going one way, then bam, his scoring turns the tide. Rockets trail by seven. Outside, Martin. And now around two minutes gone by in this half. Teardrop shot, and good that time. Martin's got 27. Well, I like this execution coming out of the half. Solid. Three for four from the field so far. Kobe kicks to our test. Passes it to Odom. To the inside. And stolen by Yao. Here's Martin. And finished off by Martin. Oh, terrific hustle for Martin. Working hard to stay out ahead. And so Fisher will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. This all deciding where to go with it. Outside, Fisher. There's 
three pointers off the mark. Houston's gotten a positive outcome on seven of their 14 three pointers in this game. Not bad at all. Outside, Mark for the tie. That's in coming off an assist from Lowry. Lowry's got his sixth assist on the night. And he got loose from the three point range in the first half and showing signs here that he's still got the flow in the second. Now, here is our test. Seven points in the game. Gasol's in the post, defended by Yao. Lock at six. Carries it down low. Gasol's got five points in the quarter. Inside, Gasol is deadly. I mean, his height means finding a shot this close, not too much work at all for him. Now, here's Lowry. Outside, Mark. Daddy A for three. It's hauled in by our test. LA's gone 0-2 from deep to start things here in the second half. Here's Odom. Count it and the foul. Kyle Lowry picks one up there. Odom was not going to allow that foul to keep him from scoring the ball. Well done. This will be his third free throw shot of the game. On the free throw, no good. Rockets trail by four. Right side, Lowry. Pass to Batty. Outside, Martin. Beyond the arc. Bangs home the trifecta. Martin's got 15 points in just the second half. He's found his rhythm from deep, and, and you can see the confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident, too, as a matter of fact. I mean, you're stacking up threes the way he is. I mean, he's doing all this work from behind the arc. Now here's Gasol. 13 points in the game. Odom. Through the net again. He's done that 10 times tonight, and he's only needed 11 shots to get there. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Yeah, I think they've got to ramp up the aggressiveness. If they don't, things are just going to get worse from here. Timeout called the Rockets. All right, a chance to check out stats for Gasol. Coming off a terrific season, fourth in rebounding, and he was such a reliable option offensively, finishing in the top 10 in field goal percentage. And he's so physical, so explosive. You really can't keep him off the glass when he wants to get there. That's why he was a top five uh, rebounder a season ago. Rockets trail by three. Outside, Scola. Eddie outside. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. Defensively, they just look out of sync, not closing out on the threes in time. Well, I think they're getting caught in that in-between zone, no man's land, giving up three straight from beyond the arc right now. And here is Odom. Shane Battier getting his three to go. Los Angeles shooting their seventh and eighth attempts at the foul line tonight. Taking two shots. And that one falls for Odom. Uyajic is checked in for the Lakers. And so he makes both from the line. Houston's got 12 of their points from long range in the third quarter, going four of five shooting. It's Martin on the wing. And Gasol comes to help. Scola finds Lowry. Shot clock at six. 
No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Odom, the pass to Bryant. And the rebound goes to the Rockets. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on him. Here's the lob to the hoop. And finished off by Martin. Oh, an explosive move by Martin going up high to get that out of you. And so Fisher will bring it up for Los Angeles. Outside, Bryant. Gasol up top. Dow with the block. Outside, Lowry. For the lead, Lamar Odom pulls it in. Odom's got seven rebounds in the game. And there's the pass to Vujicic. Kobe, that's for two. Los Angeles with another miss. Oh, he just cannot buy a bucket, guys. I tell you what, that's a painful quarter for him, and it's painful for me to watch, too. In the corner, Battier with it. Outside Lowry. Pass to Martin. Dives for it, and it goes out of bounds. The last touch they say by Martin. And now, let's take a look again at that incredible rejection. Boy, he is all over that shot. I mean, had it read the whole way, got himself in the position, and then was able to make the play. Aaron Brooks, he's checked in for Kevin Martin. Lakers have gone a somewhat so far 4 of 10 on their shots in the second half so far. Vujicic kicks to Bryant. Gasol, a screen on Batty. Kobe passes to Gasol. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. And the long arms of Gasol wreaking havoc on the D. They, they don't know what to do with him when he's going up with a shot like that. This is his second trip to the line in this one. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He's off on the first. And he sinks the second. Not an A-plus trip to the line, but he did get them the lead. against Fisher. Outside Scola. Back to Brooks. Hit by Yao for the lead. Brooks misses. The Lakers in the lead. And now in transition is Fisher. Here we go. Took him no time at all on that one. Fisher's got his third basket of the night right there. Lowry against Fisher. Scola inside. Over Odom. Gets it to fall from the right block. Scola's got six. For Los Angeles, they've gone just a bit under 50% from the field since halftime. Five out of 11. Gasol is screen on Scola. Odom, the pass to Gasol. And Gasol slams it in. Boy, as a pick-and-roll partner, you couldn't have a better guy than Pau Gasol. He's got great length, excellent hands, and a nice touch. And here's Lowe. Screen by Scola. Now Lowry. Battier dishes to Lowry. Over Fisher. And Odom pulls it down. Odom's got nine rebounds now tonight. Fisher finds Bryant. Now Odom. Caps in the tray. And it's a six-point Laker lead. And I love how Odom stretches the floor. They're always ready to shoot from distance when the defense is in focus. Brooks feeling it out a bit. 
feeds to Scola. Shoots over Odom. And there's Scola on the assist by Brooks. Brooks has got three assists in the game. Fisher, the pass to Bryant. Back to Fisher. Yow with the block. Here's Lowry. Out to the right wing. Here's Scola. Connects on the nine-footer. And now, just a two-point Laker lead. They're scoring boatloads of buckets. It's raining buckets from inside. Well, the defensive rotations have been a step slow. And it's really helped them get that ball inside time after time. It just seems like the more he touches it, the more the lead grows. Houston's got more than a 50% success rate on their three-pointer since halftime. They're four of seven. Fisher against Lowry. And it's Scola in the corner. Back to Lowry. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. Yao with a screen on Fisher. And Lowry puts up a deep three. And it's Bryant with the rebound. Man, he's just pulled a hairy Houdini in this quarter. He's completely disappeared. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. Bryant's got 15. And Kobe can score from anywhere on the floor, especially dangerous from inside. Brooks outside. From 10 feet out, Bujicic grabs the miss. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold streak. And he's got to find other ways to contribute then because his shot making is not happening right now. Now here's Gasol. He's got 18. Good. He's flipped the script here in this half, shooting a much higher percentage from the field. Lowry against Fisher. Outside Lowry. Here's Scola. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Oh, the officials are all over that foul. Clearly a foul. I mean, didn't give him any choice but to blow the whistle. I mean, you got to play without fouling. First free throw is good. Houston making some changes. Chuck Hayes, he's checked in for Yao. Jeffries comes in for Shane Battier. And Martin subbed in for Kyle Lowry. And then for Los Angeles, Barnes, he's checked in for Odom. Brown comes in for Kobe. And Steve Blake is subbed in for Fisher. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. 46 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Blake kicks to Bujicic. Down low. Here's Brown. And the layup's good off the glass. I like the play call. Very solid. Making perfect use of the pick to get a great look. Brooks the pass to Jeffers. Now here's Hayes. It's Martin on the wing. And Brown over to help. Pass to Jeffers. Brooks from outside. Hits the three-point bomb. Brooks has got nine points. And perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. Certainly. I mean, they saw a weakness in the perimeter defense and took advantage of it. Inside, from eight, and another basket for the Lakers. This is why they look to feed Gasol. I mean, his guys know how effective he is as a scorer. Here's Jeffries. And so it's Los Angeles bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. Their shooting has been the big key. Their percentage from the field so far has been terrific. And we've got more on 2K Sports coming your way after this break.
and we're three quarters behind us. Let's see what this fourth period holds in store for us. Los Angeles leading by seven. Pass to Bryant. Kicks it to Vujicic. The pass to Blake. Six on the shot clock. And another three for the Lakers. Big make from Vujicic. When he's hitting his perimeter shots, simply adds another dimension to this offense. Now here's Hayes. Jeffries the pass to Hayes. Brooks with it. There's the pick. He kicks it to Miller. Houston needs to get a shot. At and it's Martin missing. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Yeah, double-digit advantage on the scoreboard. They've taken the initiative. They've played, I think, with more purpose so far. Now Barnes following the miss by Martin from deep. Kobe, no good. I'm shocked that didn't turn into three points. I mean, he makes you pay on those nearly every time. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. You love how Masai has risen to the challenge throughout this one. Hey, defense is taking a back burner. Secondary on the marquee, but who doesn't love a game like this? Let's go. I like offense. Harper, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Lakers leading by seven. Barnes outside. This is to Harper. Over Miller. Harper, no good. You know, the fact is, he's not a lock from there, but he was open enough to where he should have hit that shot. Back to Brooks. Here's the screen. Trains it from beyond the arc. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Here's Vujicic. Here's Bryant. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. The motor of Bryant never stops, even inside where he goes right at the deep. In a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Lakers. They bullied the defense here in the paint. Look at all of those buckets inside. Just hard to defend in the paint. And another thing they've been exceptional at is their passing. On target ball movement has gotten them a lot of assists tonight. First free throw is good. You know, Kobe is the total package. Not just an elite score, but a very talented, versatile defender, too. And he makes both free throws. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. As to Hayes. He feeds it to Miller. Harper with the steal. Now Vujicic passes to Blake. Here's Vujicic. Kobe with it. Five to shoot. With the floater. Count that one. Kobe's got four points now in the quarter. And his presence as a scorer, it, it just has a calming effect for the rest of the team. He's a fallback option whenever they need him. Now here's Hayes. Brooks, the best to Miller. That drops and it comes off an assist from Brooks. Brooks has got his fifth assist in this one. Around three minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Here's Bryant. Rockets with the rebound. Here is Jeffries. He dishes it to Hayes. 
Martin kicks to Hayes. Jeffries the pass to Hayes. Brooks outside. Barnes grabs the miss. You know, even though it's a point-blank range shot, that's not an easy one, especially when the defense is that tight. Here's Harper, and the layup is good. And the Lakers lead by eight. You make your teammates better by giving them good passes. That one was perfect. Brooks outside. A teardrop falls in. Boy, that was a sweet-looking teardrop. There's very little defense for that. Pass to Vujicic. Kobe draws it up, kicks to Barnes, lets it go with a three. It's rebounded by Hayes. Hayes has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Hayes with the screen for Martin. Misses the three. Enzo Bryant will bring it up for Los Angeles. Six-point lead. Vujicic dishes to Bryant, and there's the foul. It'll go on Aaron Brooks. That is his first foul of the game. Yao checked in for Houston. And then for the Lakers, Theo Ratliff comes in for Harper. And Fisher subbed in for Steve Blake. So it's the Lakers now. And here's Bryant outside. Drills it from outside. Bryant's got nine points here in the second half. Boy, this really is Kobe's game in a nutshell. I mean, it's the biggest part of his game, his ability to score. And he looks to be aggressive, hunting his shots. Now here is Martin. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. Houston making some changes. Luis Scola, he's checked in for Hayes. Hattier comes in for Jared Jeffries. And it's Kyle Lowry in for Aaron Brooks. Shannon Brown, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Who's got Jerry? Fisher looking it over. Kobe draws the double. There's the triple. Nobody near Barnes. And that comes off the assist by Derek Fisher. And the Lakers lead by 12. Oh, great ball movement there. Outside, Martin. Left side, Lowry. Stolen by Ratliff. To the paint. Here's Barnes. Lakers in the ball around now. Kobe, no luck. For Houston, they've gone 4 of 7 from the field since the beginning of the fourth. Fisher against Martin. The pass to Lowry. To the left wing. And Shannon Brown picks up the foul. That's his first foul. Paul Gasol is checked in for the Lakers. Odom comes in for Barnes. Paul Gasol. Lamar Odom. Outside Lowry. Maddie outside. Six to shoot. From outside the arc. That one's in there. The Lakers lead is cut to just nine points on the basket from Kyle Lowry. You can't let Lowry get comfortable from beyond the arc because he's more than capable of hurting you from there. Now here's Kobe. Here's Gasol. And he banks in the layup. 24 points for Kyle Gasol. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Guys, when you're this hot, it's elementary. Let it fly. Keep staying at it. Here's Martin. Yao, the pass to Scola. Good work there as it goes. And it's really been a tale of two halves, guys. A slow start, but this quarter, he has really been the man. Bryant against Batty. And Bryant kicks to Fisher. A pass to Bryant. Kobe soaring through the air. This just proves how tough Kobe is. Brushing off the defense inside, a no-brainer. Scola sets a screen for Lowry. Over Fisher. Shot is good in the Los Angeles leads. Cut to just nine on the basket from Kyle Lowry. Luis Scola setting a really nice screen that time. Timeout called the Lakers. 
adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. test is checked in for Brown. And the wait is now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Guys, during that last break, I heard Phil Jackson as he talked with the team. Now he wants his team to stop playing it safe. He said, we've got this lead by doing what we do, and we can keep it if we don't get too cautious. Play our game. Kevin? Thank you, David. Oh. Gasol dishes to Odom. Back to Gasol. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. That's on Yao Ming. And Gasol is a master at utilizing his strength inside, forcing the defense to become physical with him whenever he has the ball in deep. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw drops for Gasol. Of course, he didn't have an attempt there in the first half. He's hoping to be a little bit more active and aggressive here and draw some fouls here in the second. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Well, he's come through for them at the line today, and you love having a big fella who's so capable on his free throw. Scola finds Martin. Outside Lowry. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. Encouraging signs for him after starting the game poorly. He's picked it up here in the second half. Fisher, the pass to our chest. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Lamar Odom. That'll be his second foul of the game. Second team foul. Rockets trail by eight. Now, here's Lowry. Outside, Mark launches it. The shot's good on the assist by Lowry. Lowry's got his ninth assist in the game now. And the D has gotten a little bit laxed here, defending the triple. Now, here is our test. Lakers passing it around. Odom kicks to Fisher. Our test on the way. Good looking screen by Gasol. And right away, they match it with a three pointer of their own. And the Lakers lead by eight. And it's Lowry with the ball, brings it up for the Rockets. The dish to Battier. Outside, Mark. It's back to Battier. And there's the feed to Martin. Just five on the clock. Here's Lowry. The Lakers with the rebound. Odom's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Another rebound hauled in. They're hitting the glass with a lot of passion. Guys, that's been the key to their lead. I mean, simply put, the effort they've displayed on the glass has been the difference. Here's Gasol and stolen by Stola to the middle. Here's Lowry. And it's Fisher with the rebound. Lakers leading by eight. Our test on the way. A floater. Rockets with the rebound. Ryan against Martin. Some solid defense from Kobe. Lakers have got a pretty good rhythm going offensively, shooting 8 of 15 for the quarter. Tries the spin move. Martin with the block. Great D that time from our test. Los Angeles has gone 4-7 with the long ball here in the fourth quarter. Fisher, right side. 
Stola against our test. Shot clock at six. And that comes off the assist by Derek Fisher. Fisher's got five assists tonight. Coaches want the ball in his hands because Fisher makes good decisions. He's got a really good basketball mind. Now, here is Martin. Patty hey, outside. Left side, Lowry. Trying to end the drought. They retain possession. And Yao gets it to go. 121 left in the fourth quarter. Los Angeles leading by eight. Here's Odom. And Strola with the block. Pass to Martin. Yao with a screen on Kobe. A three. A rebound by Gasol. Nothing's going his way since the horn. I mean, looks like he used up all his mates in the last quarter. Outside our test. He kicks it to Bryant. Bryant is doubled. Tipped away. It's stolen by Lowry. Kevin Martin on the win. Lets it go with a good. Another from three. He's got his defense scrambling. And even when they've got two guys on, he just finds a way to create space. And he's making some team history. He just tied the franchise record for three-pointers in a single game. And he commits the intentional foul. Second personal foul. Fifth team foul. Shooting for Los Angeles. Derek Fisher at the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. the first free throw missing for him we'll see if he can nail the second you know I look at Derek Fisher and I see steadiness and reliability I mean night in and night out this guy produces for you on the floor and he does everything with the good of the team in mind timeout called the Rockets they're trailing by six 34 seconds left in the fourth guys what do you think yeah, trying to get back in this thing. They need a score. Yeah, and they need it hiccup fast. I mean, they'll be drawing up a quick hitter in the huddle here, no doubt. against Bryant. It drops. And now they trail by just four. And again, it's Yao Ming. I mean, we always talk his size, and that does help, but Yao also has terrific touch. Shooting for the Lakers. Derek Fisher. Two shots. on the first and that puts them up by five. And so both free throws are good. It's a six point ball game. You know important for him to come through at the line there because they want to expand that lead. Now a timeout called by Houston. They're down by six. 26 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Six seconds left here in the fourth quarter. 
Orton against Odom. Good! And now they trail by just four. And this is how much Martin's guys believe in him, right? Because he knows how to deliver in the clutch. No choice but to foul there, but he's probably the last guy you want to see on the line. But there was no time really to be selective. Stopping the clock was the priority. Shooting two. Drops the first one, and that puts them up by five. Second one is good. Getting both at the line, and it's a six-point ball game. On offense, here are the Rockets. Martin, the pass to Scola. Patty A for three. They get it again. And it's still a rare sight to see rebound numbers like the one he's had tonight. Boy, he has put in some major work. He's earning his pay, for sure. Two shots. Shooting two. Gets the first, and that makes it a seven-point lead. And so he drops them both. It's an eight-point game. Battier outside. This one for three. Gets the three to fall. And Battier, a consistent threat from deep, has a great stroke from the outside. And so Los Angeles takes the win. This was a hard-fought, well-earned victory for him, Greg. They really had to work for this win. That's a good point. I mean, well, weaker teams might have buckled at the end with the crowd amped up, everyone in the building kind of rooting against you. But they stood tall and pulled it out. Well said. And that'll do it for the first game of the NBA season. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. So long.